Let's start with a question. What is it about this game that makes us care so much? Wait, I thought you said we were going to be home in time to watch TV. Buddy, I told you, we got a few more errands to run. Don't worry, there'll be other games. Because here's the thing. Not everyone gets it. Yes, including loved ones. This is ridiculous. I'm just going to go without you. We've been hearing it for generations. They say we're wasting our time. They say we get too carried away. It doesn't really mean anything. It's a silly obsession. They say it's just a child's game. How did he do that? I think we're having a little bit of fun now. Yes, every sport is a child's game. It's undeniable. But that's exactly the point. As children, we were careless, reckless, and often fearless. This little guy? Well, he still is. And that's why we watch. Because somewhere along the line, Patrick Mahomes, the magic show! He became a magician. Did it, baby! They say we need to grow up. But why? He never did. Yes, he's cool. Victory Cigars designer shades cool. In winning games, they say he's not supposed to. Why do we care so much? Come on. Have you seen these guys? Have you seen these teams? In this league, if you want to be the best, you have to beat the best. And these two superheroes know that. You want a rivalry? These quarterbacks are going to be in it over and over again. All too well. Tonight, two AFC rivals, led by youthful fearlessness, look to take that final step onto the grandest stage in sports. They say, why bother? It's just a bunch of grown-ups playing a child's game. You know what? They're right. And that's exactly why we watch. Like we have for generations. With the Super Bowl, only one game away. Beautifully told by Pete Radovich, child's game, who is, in fact, a game that will take one of these teams to Super Bowl 57 as the Chiefs take the field at Arrowhead. Here we go. You got to change the script somehow, right, fellas? So, Bengals, Chiefs, on Burrow, under no matter what the pressure, he is really cool. Patrick Mahomes, you know about the high ankle sprain. You know about Travis Kelsey's bad back, but coming out of the gates, they look good. It's a 16-yard pickup. Third and five from the 25. Kadarius Tony. he just can't quite haul it in. It'll settle for a field goal. You know, if he could squeeze that ball and just somehow roll over on his backside early, he may hold on to that completion, but at least they got the three out of this one, boom. Could the bigs on the Kansas City Chiefs take advantage of the wounded Cincinnati line early on? Yes. Frank Clark had a big first quarter. He and Willie Gay. Then, after delay a game of penalty third and 18, Chris Jones. He's been the best defensive tackle in the NFL all season, boom, and today was no different. And so, the Bengals forced to punt. Now, second 11, Mahomes has time. He can step into it as he can. Oh, the lateral from, uh-oh. A lot of these laterals, there's Kelsey McKinnon, they were having fun, but e. Yeah, she's getting a little bit too cute with the hook and flateral, not lateral, the, in the flat. In the flateral, <laughs> that's a field goal by Butker, 6-0 Kansas City. Now Joe Burrow. That's a nice play to Tyler Boyd. Their wideouts are going to cause trouble. That young Kansas City secondary, Sneed, their best corner, got hurt and left the game early on. Burrow to Hayden Hurst, tight end, not able to call it, haul it in almost. Here it is again, a tight, nice throw on the sideline, but he didn't have those pinkies together. He let it go through the bread basket. So who would have guessed six to three between these two great quarterbacks? Bengals got a field goal. Mahomes to Marquez Valdez, Scantling. They needed a receiver to step up, and he did. Key, good catch. He, he he did in a big way, but the great thing about that catch is Patrick Mahomes actually saved him for a terrible hit. 29-yard pickup, Mahomes rolling right, and yes, it's on fourth and one, and they're going to throw that play to Kelsey. It's 13-3, to Chiefs. But, oh, the 
Bengals down against the Chiefs? They don't care. They're firing. But the youngster, Jalen Watson, had that pick in that Thursday night game at a pick last week. One of the many youngsters in Burrow that looked like, you know, the pass rush bothering him. Yeah, one of two picks in the day for Burrow, Boone. An empty Chiefs drive, though. Burrow now. Oh, the ball is popped into the air. The hit by Cook. And Juan Thornhill there, 22, but there is a flag, Brian Cook, with the hit. Yeah, very good call by the ref. He got that tick early. Good call. Now the Bengals trying to score before the half, as they do. Jamar Chase, Chiefs extra uh, special on him, or they tried to be. Pretty much held him under wraps, except in a couple of key spots. Burrow. T. Higgins, 21 yards. Whenever you got a big body like this, and, and Boog knows this by playing with me, myself, back shoulder throws in this situation is always great. Eight seconds go, second and goal, the throw to Higgins. It's a little high, so the is going to settle for a field goal after a long drive. 13-6 at the half, Kansas City. Third quarter, same score. Joe Burrow, Higgins. How's that play? He's tall than these guys. Taking candy from a baby, it was just too easy, boom. And the Bengals coaches say, yep, we throw to our bigs. They're, they, they've got the, they can make the moves on the Cincinnati and the Kansas City DBs. We're tied at 13. Mahomes, meet Cole Harden. We haven't seen him in a month and a half, and he hauls it in, but Mahomes hobbling off the throw. Yeah. And then Mahomes. You knew he'd be the hobble at some point. Valdez Scantling, this is a big play in the game. It's a 25-yard pickup. Kansas City on the move. That was a second and five. Third and seven at the Bengals 26. Mahomes. Valdez Scantling looks short. They ruled it short, but he reached out and they took a long look. Really heady play by MBS. Body was stopped, boom, but reached the ball out. First down after the review. So Zach Taylor was not pleased at all. It was right on the line. They give him a first down, third and ten. Mahomes. Valdez Scantling for the touchdown. Mahomes is limping, but it's a happy lift because the Chiefs have regained the lead 20 to 13. Keeping your head and eyes downfield at the quarterback spot is always a plus because the receiver breaks free away from the corner. Touchdown for the Chiefs. Now, next Kansas City drive. Mahomes back to pass, but he loses the ball. Slick day. I mean, the wind chill was probably under 10. Sam Hubbard, the hero in the Ravens game, recovers it for Cincinnati. Yeah, that ball's a little slick. It's five degrees, maybe zero wind chill. Ball just slipped out of his hand. And so the turn over, which plagued them in the regular season in their loss to the Cincinnati Bengals. Burrow, back to pass. Chase, there he is. You can't keep him down forever. Team. Whenever you look at this route that he ran was with essentially a pump five. He caught the ball between two defenders. I don't know what the safety cook was doing right there, not paying attention. <laughs> Second and goal from the two. Samadji P. Ryan is in. He makes a beeline, just P. Ryan for the end zone. And we're tied at 20. Fourth quarter, same score. Burrow, Dropping back to pass with eight minutes to go. He's going to slide for a first down. Here they come. The Chiefs fans and the Chiefs have seen this. Burrow dropping back. Ball is tipped. There's Cook and there's Joshua Williams. They, they play like five rookies back there. All told, a big play, Kansas City. Yeah, outstanding play by Cook. Not panicking, tipped the ball. His teammate came in and made the interception. Now, Kansas City ball third and 12. Mahomes. Since he passed for a start to step up here, second mm -hmm. up to the little flip to McKinnon, but there's a hold on the play, and Zach Taylor says, you know what, we're going to decline as a good move because Kansas City had to punt under a minute to go. Could Joe Burrow win it again? Oh, there's Chris Jones on third and eight. Play of the game defensively. Big time, and this is why you pay guys like this that type of money, because you need them in crucial moments, and they got it done. On the punt, Sky Moore, the third punt returner they used today, mostly due to injury, and the rookie takes it out of bounds. A big 29-yard return, third and four. Mahomes from the 47, looking to throw three, but he can't run, right? No, he can't. Yes, he can, and uh-oh. Oh, he gets the first down. Joseph Asai. Personal foul. And, and boom, you, you just can't do it. I know that feeling. You're chasing the quarterback all day, and you finally get to him, and he's out of bounds, and you still oh, want to push him. Now, now be look, smart. it might have been a chance to make another play, but this way, a 45-yard field goal. Harrison Butker. Good. It's good with just seconds to go. One final kick, and it done. And the Kansas City, that's right, come on off. We're not done yet. And so, Asai beside himself, uh, they may have had a chance anyway. They could have taken a five or a seven-yard pickup, but in the end, uh, in the house of the Chiefs, in the house of Lamar, the late Lamar Hunt, the Lamar Hunt Trophy, the AFC Championship, 
goes to the Kansas City Chiefs, who'll be going for the Super Bowl for the third time in four years, dethroning the AFC defending champ, Cincinnati Bengals. The Bengals had won 10 in a row. They almost won this one. Chiefs 23, 